guys, it's Jana and Meridian again. We're back with another gnome. Everybody loves their gnomes. These are created using a pom-pom in our yarn department, faux fur pom-pom that you can use to put on a hat if you crochet or knit a hat. We're using that as the base of our gnome. Then I took our lights collection of our six by six wool felt squares. These are the perfect size to make the hats. You take one of your squares, fold it in half, so you have a triangle shape. I glued down one side using hot glue or whatever glue you have, and then rounded the corner with some scissors. There's my hat. Now I'm just gonna take my Fabri-Tac because that's the glue I like. So I put some glue on the inside of this. So now all I'm gonna do is slide the hat, crinkle it up as I go, over my pom-pom, just like this. Then I'm gonna take a three quarter inch wood ball. This is a wood bead. Don't worry about the holes in it because it'll get covered up by the hat or the beard. Apply a little glue to the hat, to the nose. And stick him right down in here. And then you can fuss and, and fold your hat however you like. Actually, that looks really cute like that. <laughs> All right. Then I took the black square out of the Wolf Felts collection and I cut two little feet shape because he's got to have shoes. Take your glue. You can get it to come out of the bottle. Put some glue on the back of one shoe. Figure out where you want him to sit on the front of your gnome and glue him down. Glue to the second foot. And glue him down. So when he's sitting in a little pot, he looks like he's got his little feet because you angle him in just like this. Then we have these wonderful little flowers, these little craft daisies. Um, we take the daisy itself, just pull the head off, just like that. Add a little glue. And throw it on his little hat and you have a wonderful little spring gnome. And then you can fuss and fold the hat and crinkle it up and do whatever you want with it.